In Perry, mayor and council spent months planning to make that city better for folks who live and work there. The result, a new strategic plan. Tonight, Kalisha Moore explains what that plan is and what it means for you. Hey, how are you? Shannon Smith lives and works in the heart of Perry. Well, I've lived in Perry since like 2010, and I live over there in the um, historic downtown Perry is what it's called. She recalls when she moved to the city. It wasn't as lively as it is now. Not really much, just a fair, you know, when it would come or livestock or whatever. Stuff like that, the Cowboys, you know. Fast forward, the city is known for having all types of events to keep the community engaged. That's credited in part to what's called a strategic plan. The strategic plan is sort of a guiding plan for the next five years of the city. It was a plan that the mayor and council wanted to get together and really game plan where they want the city to go. Holly Wharton, Perry's community planner, says the list of strategic planning goals includes things like recruiting new businesses to Perry, expanding community policing efforts, and focusing on the city's boom. Perry is growing rapidly. We're growing to the east and to the south. So a lot of that is new development. But we also want to make sure we're paying attention to our core neighborhoods, and those are located closer into downtown. Each city department has a goal they will work towards in the upcoming fiscal year, but Wharton says they've already started. You know, we're really wanting to be proactive with this plan and make sure that um, we're able to meet all the goals in there within the five years. To keep Perry booming going forward. In Perry, Kalisha Moore, 13 WMAZ News. The city also plans to focus on blight, creating a competitive sports complex and expanding community policing. Holly Wharton says the plan goes into effect in July.